Hi hey everyone, Ronan and Chain. Uh, this is episode three of Paper Girls. Um, the last episode, yeesh. Um, let's see what happens. <laughs> Oh boy, he recognizes her. Holy shit. You got old. You're an actual doctor. Wait, are they gonna follow through with, with the storyline of Mac? Hey. Ask why it's me. Do I gotta tell you? You becoming a doctor? as hard to believe. If you turned out this good, then I must be out there killing it. <laughs> oh no. Jesus, you look like dad. Grandpa even. How is dad? And Alice, are they still together? What about you? Are you like married? With kids and shit? You're some kind of playboy with like nine hotties at once. What? You're My dead. My sister is dead. Yeah. Leukemia. She died of cerebral lymphoma when she was 16. Who are you? Who put you up to this? Whoa. So, okay. What did you say? My sister has been dead for 27 years. I don't know what kind of sick joke this is, but however. Dr. Coyle? I'm Donna Metcalf. I'm the social worker here. Just want to ask you some questions. You're obviously a very troubled kid. I hope you get the help you need. Are you serious? This is what you fucking think? Hey. Fuck you, dude. But all right now, there'll be no more of that. Now let's go. And she left his, her his uh, her walker. He's gonna listen to it, and it's gonna be the exact same music she listened to as a kid that he knows. Dylan's next three. I was wondering if they were gonna cut that or just change that arc that she, spoilers for people who haven't read the book. Spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. She goes to her house. Her house is still intact in the book. And there's a Spanish man who, uh, Latin person who's there. And Tiff, I believe translates. And, she t and he tells them that he bought the house from the family and that their daughter died of leukemia. Wow, so he believed her. How's he not freaking out more? This is weird. Okay, that's better. Fuck. 
Oh. Probably live with regret of not connecting with her more. Okay, there we go. After her death. Wow. God damn. Why the hell did this hit me? Oh my god. Cheap ass card Cheap ass card. <laughs> That's cool. There we go. There are scenes that are working for me. All right. All right. see a pterodactyl. The old watch is closing in on us. The girls. The girls are targets now. What? Why? They didn't do anything. Yes, they travel out of their time. That's a capital offense. Blue Monday? I think Okay How does it feel To treat me like you do 
When you told me what you've done Damn, all right. I mean, there's some parts that like, you should have done more of this, but like, okay. This might be my favorite episode. So there's, there is, some, there is one of the issues. Hold on. Copyright, 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 copyright. So there's an issue. I haven't read it yet, but there's a cover of one of the hardcovers. We see this big, you know, uh, uh, Megazord looking thing. And I'm like, what is that? I haven't gotten to that yet. So wow, they're teasing that already. Okay. But I do know about the dinosaurs. That's right out of the first two volumes. That's right out of there. I dug the episode. I dug the episode. Um, the whole plot thing of like the old uh, old watch and the uh, uh, STF, Standard Time Fighters. I think that's what they call it. I forgot the name already. Um, that's, I'm gonna have to follow that because even that through, through the, the book, I'm like, all right, so what are their goals and whatnot? And I think I might've finished right before we start the exposition. Uh, uh, period of the, the comic, but um, I like this. The, so, ah, uh, spoilers, spoilers again for the book. It, in initially, in the first two volumes, it's KJ who gets separated. Mac, Tiff, and, and uh, uh, Aaron tag are tag on the whole time, and then Mac does her own thing and then comes back. But they don't meet KJ until after they left this timeline. Uh, and uh. And that's all I'm gonna say because they there's some more implications after that, and uh, but I like this. I dug this episode. Uh, there's beautiful moments. Uh, that Dutchy moment in the car with the brother and Mag that that hit home for me. I got misty eye, and uh, again just her uh, old Aaron's approach, more like I'm sorry and be like, be like instead of more being like, I'm sorry like is everybody okay? Have you been hurt? Are you hungry? Why not? Just checking in on them. And then letting young Aaron be like, I'm sorry, I yelled at that. that was stupid of me to do it. And just like, you're a kid, you gotta learn. Learn one thing now, don't be a dick. <laughs> the ending choice music was perfect. Um, I like the mistrust and no trust. I dug that. Again, I feel, I feel caught between times because I know stuff that's differently played out than in this version of the show, but I dug that. Uh, now the girls know where they're in. And hopefully the next episode they're like, wait, what? There's a big mech? We're in this big battle or what? Um, but yeah, uh, that's it for this reaction. Hope you dug it. Uh, let's see, hopefully it stays on a steady course and we'll see where this show leads us. Uh, thank you again, take care, and I'll see you later.